What's up, everybody? How you doing? This is Max Boogie from Wall Street. Got this EA Sports UFC Black Belt Division gameplay coming out, man. You already know this in Black Belt. Just how the way this dude is using Donald the Cowboy Cerrone. Donald Cerrone is probably one of my favorite fighters, but the way that whoever was using him this game, um, if you don't know, I'm on the left. The, my opponent is on the right. I'm using Conor McGregor. Got the big tattoo on his chest. But this is what it's like to fight in the black belt division. Most of the fights, it's probably going to be like this. Where everybody, they they pick somebody. Usually they got good reach. Probably like Carlos Condit if they like in the welterweight division. They got good reach. And they just spam that X button right quick. They just hit, it, hit jabs all day. Probably like 10 in a row before they even stop. And think about, oh, let me get my stamina back up. So you know what? Since I knew he was doing that, and I knew I hate fighting people that do that, this whole first round, even though it was lagging a little bit, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna say nothing about that, though. It was lagging. But this whole first round, I was like, all right, you got it. So I just started backing up. I wasn't gonna throw no punches. I was just gonna taunt him the whole fight. You feel me? I taunted him the whole first round. Now he's trying to grab me. You know what I'm saying? He probably knew what he was gonna do. He's probably more of a grappler than a striker, you feel me? But it's so annoying to get jabbed to death. Like, in this game, like, if you get hit with a jab and you're about to punch, it makes sense. You know what I'm saying? You get stopped. That that punch is not effective if you got jabbed in the middle of it. You know what I'm saying? That makes sense. It's real. It really does. But what doesn't make sense is that people just use this. They, they just use the jab forever. You feel me? And it's like... You can try, you can parry it, but it comes so quick that even if you do parry it, you don't have enough time to get another punch off. So it's really like you don't really want to parry it because he's going to hit you with another jab anyway. And he's going to counter your punch that you're about to hit him with. You're going to counter your counter strike after that parry with another jab or, or probably like a weak, a little quick leg kick or something like that. So it's real dumb. Right now he got me on the ground, but I'm all right. I'm cool. You know what I'm saying? I'm just keeping the trim, keeping it all right. Yeah, I know when I get up, I'm going to knock him out. And that's this is not the only reason I'm making this video. This man, Conor McGregor, said that he can bet $3 million that he will knock his next opponent out. His next opponent is Chad Money Mendez. He was supposed to fight um Jose, 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 whatever, Aldo. And for the chat for the uh, for the title. But um he Aldo got hurt. You know, it's understandable, unfortunately he got hurt. So we're not gonna see a title fight um this weekend. We're gonna see something crazy though. Because if I was Chad Mendez and my if I was fighting anybody and they say I bet three hundred three million dollars that I'll knock you out, I'd be feeling some type of way. You feel me? I'll I'll come into this fight, I'll probably low blow him as soon as the fight start. And then start fighting, you know what I'm saying? I don't care. You know, if I get disqualified, oh, I, I'm still beating on I'm still about to still about to kick on you right quick. You know, catch these hands for, for saying that. But this is going to be a great fight, man. Conor McGregor is really like a striker. He's really confident, really arrogant. Some people might say, I like him. You know, I like him a little bit. He brings some the entertainment factor back to the UFC. It's kind of like, he's kind of like Adrian Broner or like Floyd Mayweather in boxing. But people actually like him. People don't like Floyd Mayweather because he doesn't really knock people out like often. You know what I'm saying? He just wins. You feel me? And then they're oh, he always winning. And they judges, all these judges always going. You know what I'm saying? But Conor McGregor knocks people out, and for him to say that, that's really wild. You know what I'm saying? So Lee, y'all thoughts about that, man? I, I don't know. It just I just saw it today. I'm like, man. I, I want to know what other people think about it. So leave your comments about that in the comment section. But we back into this fight. Second round. I'm still look at this. Look at this. Look at this. You can't even, like, back away from it. I'm still taunting him, though. I'm laughing this entire fight because I know if I stand up and start striking with this man, I'm going to knock him out. Especially because I got him out of his game because I was taunting him the whole first round. He hasn't done anything, like, significant to me. You feel me? So I'm just laid back right now. I got my hands down. We still taunting out here, dodging that because I knew he was doing. He's so predictable. Starting to parry these strikes. I can get a nice body hook in, so... If you ever wanted to play UFC online and make it to the black belt division, I suggest that you don't. You know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to get relegated, but I'm just trying to play right now. I'm just trying to have some nice fights. And it's probably not best to have a nice fight in the black belt division because you're going to get the cheese. Some people say it's takedown cheese in this game. I don't really think so because I don't really take people down. 
whenever I want, you know what I'm saying? I don't really, I don't know it. It never happened to me, you know what I'm saying? I, if I get take, look at the, yo, his hand's moving so fast, bro. It's so crazy with these jabs. And he switched it up. Now it's a leg kick that, that comes quicker than a jab. So I don't know. Now my leg is all red. You can see it's hitting me. But you know what? I taunted him again. You know what I'm saying? I know what he's about to do. If I start taunting, I got to move my head back. Because he's going for that big strike. Now we're getting our combos going. Got the little hooks, uppercuts. We kicking on this man. He's starting to back up. Because he done wasted all his stamina. Just trying to kick. Trying to dodge. I don't know what he's doing now. But I know the fight over. Look at his body. He's still moving like that. This game over, you feel me? Now I'm coming back. Came back on this man to kick on him. I don't know why none of them kicks landed to his body, but we gonna hop on him anyway, start beating him up again, even though he knocked out. So let's go. We get the W on my boy, Conor McGregor. And that's, leave a like, because I just beat up like one of the most annoying types of fighters online in UFC, because I really hate playing people who just jab. I'd rather get, I'd rather play somebody that just tries to take me down the whole fight rather than somebody that just jabs and like jabs the whole fight. No, no other combination, just five jabs to the face. I'm gonna back up and then block. I'm gonna come back in, five more jabs to the face. Like it's so dumb. So not realistic. That's the only thing that makes this game not realistic, you feel me? But I'm watching that fight. This video about to end. Stay tuned. Keep watching these videos. And, um, and always remember, in the street we trust. I'm out.